basically just expanding static budget. Okay, a short exercise, just a definition before I move forward. See if you can guess some of these. We talked about a few, not all of them. So the first one is summarized budget for several levels of volume that separates variable costs from fixed costs. This should be a flexible budget. So just by its name, it's not that restricted to just a certain level. We expand it to different levels. It could be more than three. It could be expanded to 3,000 and 10,000 and up. Depends on company's um, preference. The second, the budget prepared for only one level of sales volume. So that static budget, what we did in a previous chapter, just a set of sales budget and then a set of operating expenses budget, inventory budget, together is operating expenses budget, operating budgets. Third, the differences between actual and the budget number. Just simply the definition of variance, differences. Now, fourth and fifth, I haven't covered in more details. So we're going to talk about this in the next section, but perhaps you can guess which ones. So sales volume variance is for which one? Then what about fifth? So the fourth one is harder. The definition is more complicated, flexible budget variance. But if you don't know the fourth one, the fifth one here is just based on number of units difference. So it's obviously is the volume differences. Okay, so what this part means, the fifth part basically means the differences between master and flexible budget. Meaning at the end, if we know that our actual output is $10,000, and then we match against $10,000 flexible budget column with our static budget, the only difference is just the $2,000 units, the sales volume difference. Everything else is, should be the same because we said $8 variable expense per unit. We said $20,000 fixed expenses. This bottom part should be exactly the same as master budget. Okay, the fourth part here is really what we're going to go into more details in this chapter. The differences between actual and flexible budget, which occurs for the remaining part of differences. Perhaps variable expenses is not $8 when we actually sell the items out. Perhaps fixed expenses is not really ten or $20,000. It's more than that or less than that. So that's the part we're going to dig into more flexible budget variance later in the chapter. It's occurred because, it's occurred not because of sales volume, but all the other areas, variable expenses or fixed expenses.